Hey, what's up? You know what's up. You're cheating on me. Can you give me a chance to explain myself? No, you had your chance. Car. What kind of car was he driving? Uh, it was silver. Silver? Yeah. Was there anything else about the car? Or? Um, he had devils, devils. On, the, on the tire. On the, on the, okay. Yeah. Um, do you remember his eye color, hair color, anything? Brown. <coughs> it's all brown. Everything's brown? Yeah. Okay. Did you, uh, <laughs> did you see any digits on the license plate? A few. Such as? <laughs> I don't know specific. So you don't know? No. <laughs> okay, um, was there anything else that was unusual? Uh, the blood. The blood? On the Batty crew. He threw it. Where did he throw it? Yeah. <coughs> On the side of the house. The side of the house? Yeah. The side of the house. Alright. <coughs> Alright, I think that's it. Thank you for coming in. Oh, you're so welcome. Okay. We'll call you if you need you, okay? Okay. Wow. That looks uh, pretty bad. Alright, how about you take some pictures of the scene and I'll uh, take some fingerprints from okay. this doorknob. Doesn't look like there's anything down here. Well, let's see what we've got. What did the witness say was the murder weapon? There's some blunt. It looks like I got some fingerprints here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take some tape. Alright, make sure you do the inside of the drawer yeah. too. Alright. Alright, I'm gonna look over here for fibers after this. Alrighty, very good. All right, I've got the print. Okay. I'll put it in the bag here. You got some sort of fiber. Looks like clothing. All right. We're good. I've got the print in the bag. I'm gonna label it. witness say that the murder weapon was? Uh, she said the side of the house. Alright, let's, let's check the side of the house first. Okay. So. This must be the victim's car. Yeah. Check behind. 
behind the Uh, I'm just gonna get some measurements on this side. Okay. It's about 30 inches from this from the, the garbage. Garbage pit? Yeah. Okay. Let's check. Let's check if there's the line comes here. We got about. Get about 42 inches. From the middle of the bat? Yeah, from the middle of the bat to the to the door. Okay. All right. Let me just get one more picture from over here. All right, I'm gonna take some measurements. How about you uh, sketch the scene? All right. Let's see what it is in the face. Looks like she got hit in her zygomatic process. And it looks like it's about eleven inches from her face to the uh, to the wall here. Okay. Um, I'm gonna measure to the bandage here. What do you think happened? I don't know, but she got hit pretty hard. Well, we know that the murder weapon was a bat, so he must have. Hit her from this angle if the blood was to go on the wall over here and her head was facing that way. Yeah, clearly there's blunt force traumas in the mastoid process in the frontal lobe. 26 inches from the bandage to the head. How tall is she? Let's see. She looks to be about 57 inches. Okay, so I'm getting the hairs out. Where'd you find that? On the stairs? Yeah, the it was on the stairs. Alright, well this could be the dead body the victim or, or the suspect. suspects. It's short and it's black. Okay, well that's not, it's probably not the victim. The victim she had, had long, long brown long, hair. Alright, so I'm going to check. This is the fingerprint I got. From where? From the doorknob. From the inside? Yeah. Okay. Um... It could be victim or suspect. Looks like there's two arches and a whorl. All right. All right. I also found a fiber. It was next to the victim. What color is it? It's red. Okay. Well, the it's probably the, from. It's a type of clothing. Well, the witness said that the. The suspect had a red sweatshirt on. So that's probably from the so sweatshirt. So it's probably from the red sweatshirt. Okay. See your name? Alex Aquos. Where were you on Saturday, January 19th at 3 p.m.? Uh, I was at a Devils game. What game was that? A uh, Devils Rangers game. Who'd you go with? Nobody. I have uh, season tickets. What was your relationship to Rebecca Berger? I don't even know who that is. Are you sure? Because we found your fingerprints on the doorknob. Okay, yeah, we had a bad breakup. I was going out with her. So it sounds like you guys had a pretty rough breakup, huh? Yeah, I broke up with her like three weeks ago. We also found your hair next to the victim, including a red fiber right there, which matches your devil sweatshirt that we confiscated from your house with a search warrant. You went to my house? Yes. I want my lawyer. Alright, well we're gonna keep you here for a while, but uh, I'll see you later. I was watching the interrogation from the other side. What did you think about it? I don't know, he seemed to have an answer for every question that I had asked him. Yeah, so. I noticed that too. He seemed like he had like a nervous tickle on it too, like he never made eye contact with you. He was yeah. tapping on the table, scratching his yeah. head. 
Yeah. So. He said it himself. He said that he had a bad breakup with Rebecca a few weeks ago. So, I mean, that makes sense. Yeah, and he also said that he was a Devils fan and he went to the Devils game. He had a Devils sweatshirt that we found at his yeah. house. So, yeah. I think we found our killer. Me too. Got him.